I'm sick and tired of your attitude. Bedroom and somebody is getting getting exposed. This could be someone in a home or in a bedroom that's got an attitude. Somebody got exposed or is getting exposed. Spirit says every time somebody comes out of a bedroom, they're seeing somebody in a home with an attitude. distance you and your partner may be physically or emotionally distant there's some distance between whoever this is possibly a couple or some people in a home they're spending a lot of time in a bedroom they're distant from the other person or people. It's because they got exposed for something. The person that got exposed has an attitude. They're, they're possibly defensive. Community. This could be a group involving a group of people. Okay, wise decision refers. Somebody made a bad decision, possibly. Misinformed, rethink, disarray, overlook, number 42. And then peace refers, number 28. Untethered, disconnected, vulnerable, unaware. Somebody could be trying to act like, someone's in the home trying to act like they're not, like they're not exposed or something or some truth didn't come out. They're defensive with attitude and trying to, spirit's telling me like they're trying to play it off as if like they didn't, ex, they didn't get exposed. This is possibly someone in a group or a community. Okay, sick and tired of your attitude. Bedroom, somebody's getting exposed. Six of Swords. Wheel of Fortune, there's a change. Somebody learned about something. They discovered something. And it's making these people more and more disconnected or there's some distance between them or someone's growing apart, possibly. Somebody could be thinking about literally moving on, sailing away. The spirit says they don't want to be there no more. Somebody don't want to be somewhere no more. They're sick and tired of this person with an attitude. They could be having an attitude a lot like on a regular basis or on most days. So someone spent a lot of time in a bedroom.
page of swordry first for cups. Okay, these people are not really talking much. Somebody's feeling a love rejected. There could be someone in a bedroom like like this, keeping to themselves in the four cups. They're not showing this person or people no love. They don't want, want to be bothered. Their their attitude could be rubbing off on you, so you're just choosing to stay in the bedroom, you're choosing to stay in bed or something. Yeah, like they're trying to act like like everything's good or something. Page of Wands. This is reversed. Ten of Wands. Something may be coming to an end. Definitely somebody walking around, possibly in a home. What an attitude. You're sick and tired of it. They may be feeling burdened. It's, it's weighing somebody down, something like that. You could have overlooked something in the past with whoever this is, or you was unaware of something. They may be feeling vulnerable because they got exposed, something was exposed. King of Cups three first. You're possibly not showing this person no love or somebody's emotionally unavailable. Someone's upset. This person with an attitude is upset about something. Seven of Swords, first death. Yeah, something was caught or exposed. You could have caught someone cheating or someone in a lie or something major was revealed. And you're possibly choosing to end it out now. Somebody could be changing their mind and deciding to move on. You could be getting ready to go stay somewhere else or go sleep somewhere else. Hanged man. Something happened to where okay, you're 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 to yourself in a bedroom. Someone's in a bedroom contemplating, thinking, waiting to end something. You got enlightened with whoever this is. You're looking at them real different. It's something like you'll never see them the same again. These people have not been they have not been talking much at all. You could not be touching them and stuff. That's what I'm hearing. Not showing them no love or affection. Karmic four of wands reversed. This is possibly a karmic relationship. Karmic connection, karmic living situation. Ace of Swords, yeah, some, something got found out. I, <laughs> I just heard something like they're walking around like their stuff don't stink. They're trying to act like their stuff don't stink or something. Like they're trying to act like <laughs> someone's like in a home trying to act like it's all good. Some of you guys, you guys could live like in a lower vibrational area. You could live in an unsafe area. That's for some of y'all, that's what I'm sensing. 
Okay, someone in the bedroom sick and tired of their attitudes about got exposed. Main male. There's a male. There's a, a masculine here too with this king of cups three first. So that could be that or another male. They're letting me know some male in a room. There's about to be a change. Take the gender where it resonates for you guys. And somebody's in despair. Yeah, this person possibly about to be moving out. They're possibly about to be moving out or they're gonna go sleep somewhere else, go to a hotel or somewhere. I just heard they're always drunk. They could be drinking more than usual alcoholic beverages. So a male in a room changed a spear. Spear says somebody been in a room basically all weekend. Dang, melancholy. House. Somebody's in a house sad or the vibes are like depressing kind of. The vibes are bad in a house. It's this, this, this vibe, this lingering like feeling in a home. You could be starting to feel like out of place or uncomfortable in your own house or this home. I'm getting the sense like it's starting to feel weird in the home. It's like the vibes. Spirit says somebody lives in a sketchy area. A, scared, a sketchy area or like a, a sketchy part of town. Oh, they're scared that they're going to do something to them. Somebody's scared somebody's going to do something to them in a home. Mm. They're afraid. This is sad. They're afraid somebody might snap or something. Pop tires. They're afraid that this person might pop their tires or something like that. They're afraid that they're going to do something. High honors. You're protected. You possibly need to leave though. You possibly need to leave for a night or something. Or figure something out. Somebody's afraid for their life with this person in a home that they're living in. They hardly go into the living room. The main area of the home, the living room or a family room, something like that is what I'm sensing. They, Spirit says they hardly ever go there. They hardly spend a time in a, the main room in the home now after something got exposed. House, yeah, siblings, someone's fearful or something. Here's the house again. So it's definitely inside of the house, bedroom inside of the house. There could be another option for a home to go to for you. That's sad. Yeah, this person, you don't trust them. They got you in fear thinking like they might snap or something like that. Withdrawal, hesitation reverse. You're withdrawn from them. You could be quitting some kind of addictions. You got awakened, you're rejecting them. They possibly had you confused, conflicted, hesitant, worried, indecisive. I'm, I'm hearing something like no sudden moves. 
Like you're afraid this person is going to do something just suddenly, suddenly, possibly um, because of their something with their emotions or something like that. Okay, somebody could be frustrated. Someone could do something, be doing something risky, some kind of natural disaster or survive. Yeah. They're possibly frustrated with you, like that you're spending so much time in a, a bedroom. They're shocked. Spirit says they're shocked. Someone's like, this is horrible. Somebody's possibly thinking something like that. Be ready for anything. And puppet. Somebody's getting ready to be honest with this karmic or whoever they're staying with. I'm afraid to finally be honest for once and tell the karmic the truth. I'm stalling. Somebody's possibly stalling on uh, moving out or sailing away in the Six of Swords. Be ready for anything. Stonewalling. This person is stonewalling someone in a the house. They're in a the bedroom just ignoring them. Possibly all weekend. That's what Spirit was telling me all weekend. You was this person's puppet. You, okay, you was possibly this person's puppet. A friend. Some of y'all friend is involved too. They have them possessed and under their control with magic. Wow. Okay, so I see what's going on. So some magic got exposed. Something like that got exposed. Something supernatural got exposed possibly. And ever since then you've been distant. This could be a, um, a community of people, group of people. They think you're their puppet. Show us more what's puppet. This person had you on strings possibly. Okay, they're saying they're trying to make you feel confused. The person in your home will try to make you feel confused. You'll know when you're ready. Summer. You are the love of my life. Somebody wants revenge. Wow, your union is protected. So it's the karmic walking around in a home with an attitude. I'm letting go of who I once was. Someone is about to come running towards you. There could be some other people involved. They see their true colors now finally sitting in regret. Yeah, someone's just in a bedroom like Dang. Someone's about to come running towards someone. It ain't over this is that you're scared of and stuff or you're worried about yourself with, worry about your life with. There's possibly some other people. Okay, let's see this energy. There's a change. Page of Wands, Four Swords first. You're getting ready to go somewhere, to set out on a new path and do something, possibly during the fall season or um, soon before the end of the year. Someone is restless or nervous about this. Possibly some male is getting ready to set out on a new path and move out. Okay, you're protected. That doesn't mean stay. <laughs> that doesn't mean stay in an unhealthy situation. Okay, someone's about to come running towards you.
three swords reverse okay there was possibly a, a third party a love triangle third party is this is this this man this masculine energy getting ready to go towards somebody run towards someone leave a house they're unhappy nine of cups reverse and they want some ace of cups they want some new love they want something new they want they're about to have a new opportunity in love so i feel like it's with someone else they're miserable with whoever this is they're tired of feeling like they have to stay hiding in a room or a bedroom eight of swords they're trying to trap them so they don't leave six of swords reverse nine of swords they're nervous some of y'all could be living with multiple people doing this So they're leaving this karmic or divorcing or separating or something, moving out. They're about to end that and go running towards someone else. Okay, shows this puppet energy. It didn't work. Six of wands reverse, ten of swords. You ended up fine. They've been doing this for a while, a long time. Could have been betraying you. You got wise to the fact that someone was trying to have you <clears throat> trying to have you as their puppet. They had you possessed and under their control with magic for a long time, but it was unsuccessful. Be ready for anything. Full reversed. Somebody's getting ready to take a risk, take a leap of faith, and have some new life. They've been hesitant. Page of Cups, Page of Wands. Yeah, you're possibly attracted to someone else. This person is going somewhere and it's with regards to love. A romantic type of thing, it looks like. Death reversed. It's almost done. Spirit says they're about to start packing up. Three of Wands is sliding out. Somebody could be emptying out some drawers. Spirit says emptying out drawers. Somebody can't believe they stayed there that long or stayed with them that long or the situation this long. So this could have been going on for a while. Revenge. Ace of Swords. Yeah, somebody, somebody was trying to get revenge. Or they are, possibly. They could be mad at you because you found out some truth. Three of Wands, they're mad because it's about to be done. They're they're possibly mad at the third party you're going towards. Dang. Oh, did we go over this? You'll know when you're ready. Knight of Pentacles reversed. You've been procrastinating. You've been procrastinating on the chain or leaving. You're possibly about to divorce this person. Hanged man. You've been waiting. Yeah, somebody's been stalling the devil. Death reverse. Yeah. You know it's done. It's over. They could have fooled you. Yeah. They had you under some magic. This person could be tied to the devil. Or they could be evil or something or something like that. You're the love of my life. Judgment. Ace of Cups. Eight of Cups. Yeah, this person got exposed. Now you're walking away towards a new love. You're in love with somebody else. That union could be protected. 
It's you and somebody else's union that you're going towards that's protected, not this one. Oh, with an empress. Wow, five of cups reversed, seven of cups reversed. Somebody could be having a reality check. There's a six of swords. Someone is possibly getting ready. Some male is possibly getting ready to go towards an empress or a feminine energy. That, okay, that could be a soulmate. That union is protected. They've seen their true colors, finally. Somebody finally got exposed. And this person in the home is frustrated, walking around with an attitude. And you're just in a bedroom. Because you're letting them go. It's the person that fooled you. Oh, they did magic. Yeah, magician reversed. Definitely did magic. They never thought you was going to know about something. Someone's about to come running towards you. Show us, show us this man. You can be getting ready to drive towards someone else or an empress. Show us this person, this masculine, getting ready to run towards someone. Okay, confession. Someone has something to tell you. This man is possibly going to confess something or someone confessed something. Challenges. Mercury retrograde. There could be electronic issues, communication issues. May need to review everything. I feel like this person has been having a lot of challenges. Um, telling the truth or communicating to some people. Possibly the person that they're going towards. Possibly the empress or whoever else this is they're staying with. They're with. There's something with communication issues I'm feeling here. Somebody is making a decision, work on inner healing. This man is possibly getting ready to tell somebody something. King of Swords. This hit, I'm letting go of who I once was. Some masculine is getting ready to confess or communicate. The tower, yeah, something just erupted. There was some kind of revelation or eruption. Ace of Pentacles. Okay, they're possibly about this masculine, this man is possibly about to offer somebody something or they're gonna take a new opportunity. There's something new here. Ace of Cups, Four of Wands. Yeah, there's this, there's like this new union. There's this new union. He's about to communicate with whoever he's about to run towards and have new love and celebrate, possibly be with them or live with them or have some kind of attend an event or a milestone or something. This is a twin flame union or soulmate union or something. 